Hello and welcome back to Detroit and Become Human. Timeline, how's it going? So, this is episode 2. Um, this is where I left off from the last video. Anyway, if you have yet seen part 1, um, it's uploaded right now. So I suggest you go watch that first before. But if you already have, then there you go. So, episode 2. We're going to carry on with the playthrough of this. Anyway, um, I mean, shit's getting interesting. You know what I mean? So... Yeah, anyway, without further ado, let's continue. Right, um, this is the flow chart from what I play this. So basically, I play Connor's story, which I played in a demo. I play Marcus's story, and then the started Kara's story. Um, so she did a cleaning, she's finished cleaning, and then, yep, Todd being a bit of a. But maybe there might be something else, maybe. Is he all as he seems to be? I, you know. But let's continue. Let's see what we're doing next. I think we're back to Marcus's story now. He's got a fancy house. Right, deposit the package. So, okay, let's take a look. Okay, take a good look at himself. There's the open. Got a little baby parrot. So the android parrots. Okay, let's see. If there's something else. Anyway, okay. Right, we can't go upstairs just yet. We need to go. There's two doors. Do you think we can enter this door? Hmm. Okay, we can't go, so we have to go through this way. Oh, wait. So where am I gonna... Oh, what's this? It's a wonderful pain. So where am I gonna deposit the package? Ah, here we go. We just put it down there. Hang on, your coat. Right. Take care of Carl. Right. So we're going upstairs. Right. So who is Carl? Is that his son? Or... Could be anybody really, but... Let's take a look. So Carl should be upstairs somewhere in here. Do we... Oh, it's his dad. Draw the curtains. All right, let's do it. Uh, good morning, Carl. Good morning. It's 10 a.m. The weather is partly cloudy, 54 degrees. 80% humidity with a strong possibility of afternoon showers. It sounds like a good day to spend in bed. I did go to pick up the paint that you ordered. Oh, yes, I've forgotten. That is the difference between you and me, right, Marcus? You never forget anything. Okay. Well, give him the medicine. Arm, please, Carl? No. Carl? Thank you. Hmm. Why if you had to make a choice whether to give him the medicine or not? Huh. Humans are such a fragile machine. They break down so quickly. All this effort to keep them going. Hey, what happened to your clothes? Oh, it's nothing. 
Just some demonstrators in the street, Carl. What a bunch of idiots. They think they can stop progress by roughing up a few androids? I hope they didn't harm you. Oh, no, no. They just pushed me around, Carl. I'm fine. Okay. I'll take you to the bathroom now. Okay. Oh, we still got to hold it. <laughs> that cat. <laughs> okay. I actually thought, yeah. And stop. I go again. <laughs> there you go. Let's see. Okay. There you go. He had a nice clean. So taken to the dining Anything table. Anything special on the agenda today? Yes, there's the opening of your retrospective at the Museum of Modern Art. Mm. The gallery director left four messages asking to confirm your attendance. Hmm. I haven't decided yet. Can't take him we'll down the stairs. Okay. What else? Oh, got the thing. Yeah. Just your usual fan mail. That's I've already thought you got a lift or something. Hmm. Any news from Leo? Well, that was no, quick. No. I can call him if you like. No. No, I don't bother. Do you know sometimes? Do you know sometimes I would call him? Okay. Any other possibilities? No. Okay. That's fine. We'll take him to the dining table, which is right in here. I'm starving. Well, your breakfast is ready. Bacon and eggs, just the way you like them. Thank you, Marcus. You're welcome. Oh, this so this is Carl's house. And he was just his carer. Serve breakfast. Right. Let's go. Oh, okay. Wait, 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 wait. I was going to say that was quick. I mean, how is breakfast ready when it's just turn up the door and put the deposit down? I mean, who made the breakfast anyway? There's got to be somebody else in the house. <laughs> I know I wake up just before 10 a.m. anyway. Serve. Thank you, Marcus. Television. Tensions continue to rise in the Arctic since Russia and Russia have declared the region part of its national territory. Several Russian warships have taken position in the barracks. I mean, it's a rich house and all that, but the cup with the smiley face is like it's actually hand-drawn by a child. But still... Why don't you find something to do while I finish my breakfast? Sure. Hmm? Okay, Carl. Okay. So. Find something to do. Is there a gym? Maybe play the piano. Yeah, we'll play the piano. Can we can we play the piano? Quantic Deluxe. <laughs> I see why it's called. Yeah, play the piano. Sit down. Go on, play us a little tune. Give us a little tune. What are you gonna play? Hopeful. Ha <laughs> <laughs> 
This is going to go on. Can we speed it up? Go on. Go on. Do it. He's actually a good pianist. So we're going to give him to it. Anyway. This is music, by the way. I think we're gonna stop. Well, what do you think, Carl? Something has changed in the way you play. <laughs> Sometimes I think you have more humanity than most humans. Okay, I'm being serious. Yeah, that, that's a good One compliment. I won't be here to take care of you anymore. You'll have to protect yourself. And make your choices. Decide who you are and want to become. This world doesn't like those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone tell you who you should be. Let's go to the studio. Take Carl to the studio. Can I check this out first? Wait, where's this? Okay, maybe not. Okie dokie. Right, let's take him to the studio. Uh, hello, thank you. Right, let's go. So I assume this is an art studio. Well, that's a big studio. Let's see where we left off. Remove the sheet. Hmm. What do we have? Let's do it. Alright, we can clean the studio. We've got to do more tidying now. Okay. Right, clean. Okay. There's more shits to do. Okay. Let's keep looking. Right, there's more. Clean. And put it on there. See, you gotta organize, categorize everything in its right place, make it look good, clean. There's paint spillage on there. Okay, can we oh, hold up? Hold up. What do we have here? Cool, good stuff. Brilliant drawings. Okay, clean this as well. Just so you know, I'm recording quite late. So... But I really want to play this anyway, so... So, how's it going, Carl? So... What's your verdict, Marcus? What if you don't like it? I like it. Yes, there is something about it. Hmm. Something I can't 
quite define. I guess I like it. The truth is, I have nothing left to say anymore. Each day that goes by brings me closer to the end. I'm just an old man clinging to his brushes. Carl. But enough about me. Let's see if you have any talent. Give it a try. Try painting something. Paint? What would I... Painting what? Anything you want. Give it a try. <sighs> Am I really going to do some painting? Find a subject to paint. Hmm. Show paint the statue? The desk. I want to. I think the statue is more. Wait in a minute. There we go. Ooh, that's that quite a perfect copy of reality. But painting is not about replicating the world, it's about interpreting, improving on it, showing something you see. Carl, I don't think I can do that. It's not in my program. I... Go on, go. Try it. Grab that canvas. So... Do something for me. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Trust me. Try to imagine something that doesn't exist, something you've never seen. Now concentrate on how it makes you feel and let your hand drift across the canvas. Wait, I see it's flashing. He's painting with his eyes closed. Do you know what? Fuck androids. Let's stick with um, identity. Um, doubts. What? Oh, you have to. Okay. Okay, and then with this. Wait, who's he? Hey, Dad. Leo. I didn't hear you come in. No, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. It's been a while, right? You all right? You don't look so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> I think he's on drugs. Uh, I need some cash, Dad. Again? What happened to the money I just gave you? Uh, well, it just goes, you know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No. No, no, I Oh, yeah, he is. No, don't lie to me. Yeah, he What is. difference does it make? I just need some cash. That's all. Sorry. The answer's no. What? Why? You know why. Yeah, yeah, I think I do know why. <laughs> you'd rather you'd rather take care of your uh, plastic toy here than your own son, right? Tell me, Dad, what's what's it got that I don't? It's smarter, more obedient, not like me, right? But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine. Leo, that's enough. Enough. You don't care about anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. 
You've never loved anyone. You never loved me, Dad. You never loved me. Need to knock some sense out of him, the fucker. Ah, Paulia, no. Paul can't, though. Did I say Paulia? No. But yeah. Okay, so as you can see, it's 59% completed. Anyway, so the outcome, Leo intruded to ask for money. Now, I'm quite interested. I might actually watch some other YouTube video and see if they got different outcomes in this. But there we go. So, let's see what else is next. Let's continue. Okay, um, Connor's back again. No androids allowed. Owners will be prosecuted. Ooh, shall we enter? Or shall we just walk away? Okay, well, we're going to enter. So, find Lieutenant Anderson. Okay, here we go. So, we need to find. Is that him? No, that's the wrong dude. Okay, uh, where are we going next? That's definitely not him. Well, but we're gonna have to. Let's see, Jimmy's bar, so I assume he's the owner. Right, let's keep walking. Wait. Restrooms. You could be in the restroom. Wait. Check. Check. Wait. Okay. Um, in the loo? Okay, not in the loo. Okay. Hold up. Wait, we can't go in there either. Hold up. Uh, wait, maybe in the far corner. Yes, found them. There we go. Right, introduce yourself. Lieutenant Anderson, my name is Connor. I'm the android sent by CyberLife. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a CyberLife android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. So just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. Understanding. I understand that some people are not comfortable in the presence of androids, but I, I... am perfectly comfortable. Now back off before I crush you like an empty beer can. Reason. Listen, I think you should stop drinking and come with me. It'll make life easier for both of us. We outside. I apologize, Lieutenant. I didn't mean to bother you. I'll wait for you outside. Take your time. Did you say homicide? Wait. 
Is that the Beastie Boys? I'm you not sure. Yeah. Be patient. Whatever you say, Lieutenant. So, the name's Hank. Conflicting orders selecting priority. So follow him. Okay, that's it. John Douglas for Channel 16. Can you confirm that this is a homicide? I'm not confirming anything. Let's follow him without being detected, so... Let's keep our distance. Okay. So that's him right there. Okay, maybe we have to move. Okay, let's go talk to that police officer right there. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. It's with me! What part of staying in the car didn't you understand? Your order contradicted my instructions, Lieutenant. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Got it. Evening, Hank. We're starting to think you weren't gonna show. Yeah, that was the plan till this asshole found me. So, you got yourself an android. Huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. We had a call around eight from the landlord. Lieutenant had to pay the rent. Something happened. Months, so he thought he. The camera switched to the other on. side. Okay, right. right let's go inside. Anyway. Jesus, that smell. It was even worse before we opened the windows. The victim's name's oh, Carlos Ortiz. He has a record for theft and aggravated Listen assault. Listen to briefing. So investigate According the, to the crime neighbors, scene. He was kind of a loner. Examine. Oh, we found, we found inside one. Stayed inside most of the time. They hardly ever saw him. Wow, stayed here. Okay, red ice. Oh, that's We're dangerous. Hydrochloric acid. So the victim morning. used the drugs. Okay. I'd say so there's one there. Well, no more than the coroner gets here. There's a kitchen knife over here. Analyze Probably before we take one. a sample. So no fingerprints. So maybe an enzyme break in. Nope. The landlord said the front door was. So it's dried blood. Locked from the inside. All the windows were boarded up. The killer must have gone out the back way. What do we know about so his hands? Two. Not much. Okay. The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. So this is right. dried blood. I, let's I gotta keep get connecting some evidence. Make yourself at home. I'll be outside if you need me. So it's a nightclub advertisement. Okay. Let's keep going. Let's go in here. Okay, Sam. So there are fingerprints, so it's a theft and so signs of a struggle. So the briefing's concluded. So do you think I made the right decision not listening to the briefing? Did I do the right thing finding the clues? We'll see. There's something else as well. Yep. I think that's a baseball bat. So, reconstruct. Okay, so the Divine took a knife. Okay. Okay, and the Divine was attacked, so emotional shock. Right, let's keep on collecting more evidence. Let's see, maybe balls? Android sex sufficiently better. Ooh, would you like that? Okay, yeah, that was... That thing. Look out the window. Can see something? Better is perfect. Yeah. 
It's way too neat. No human rights like this. Okay, let's have a look. Chris, is this written in the victim's blood? I would say so. We're taking samples for analysis. Okay, um, the victim's ready to be examined. But I want to collect more evidence. But I just don't want to be rushed. Red ice. Seems our friend Carlos liked to party. So maybe something could have happened on the outside. Analyze. The shoe prints. Door was locked from the inside. Killer must have gone out this way. There are no footprints apart from Officer Collins' size 10 shoes. Well, this happened weeks ago. Tracks could have faded. No. This type of soil would retain a trace. Nobody's been out here for a long time. So to find to escape this way. Hmm. At seven. Thanks. Consider it done, Lieutenant. Wait. Let's go in there. Hey, Mike, you finished taking samples there? Yeah. Okay, That's go it. in there. Hoping there's something here. Anyway. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Alright, let's go. I found seven. We need to find three more. Oh, that's so... Alright. Okay, what is this about red ice? Acetone, lithium, fumium, toluene, hydrochloric acid. Oh my god. Okay, so yeah, that's... Um, cars. So there are knife runes, so he was stabbed or slashed. So reconstruct. So the victim fell. Yep, he was stabbed. And they came from the kitchen. Ah, which I investigated early on, so... He was stabbed 28 times. 28 yeah. times? Seems like the killer really had it in for him. Ho ho ho. Alright, so we need to find two more evidences. There's gotta be somewhere. Wait, let me have a look down here. You're in the way. I'm not ready to talk to him just yet. Wait, I am alive. Connor, where are you going? So regular letters font cyber life. I found eight. Um, I'm gonna find it. Okay, let's check somewhere else. But I don't think it's anywhere else. I don't want to talk to him just yet. There's gotta be more. There's gotta be more. Okay, perhaps in here, maybe. I've already checked. I've already checked that. Hold up. Um dry blood. 
Oh, okay, so one more. Uh, there's one more. There's one more t um, evidence to find. Anyway. Nothing to find here. Maybe... We should read this. Anyway. Hmm. Is your android spying on you? Sixty-eight percent of men prefer sex with an android to a real woman. Hmm. I wouldn't think so. I've got to find that one evidence. I've got to find that last evidence. Where could it be? You're in my way. It's got to be something. It has to be something. It's got to be something there. Couldn't find all the evidences, so I tell you what, um, I think we should give up and talk to him. Lieutenant, I think I figured out what happened. Oh, yeah? Shoot, I'm all ears. It all started... In the kitchen. In the kitchen. There are obvious signs of a struggle. Question is, what exactly happened here? I think the victim attacked the android with the bat. With the bat. That lines up with the evidence. Go on. Ah. The android stabbed the victim. So the android was trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? The victim fled to... The garden. The garden. No, that can't be right. It doesn't fit the evidence. Oh. Um... The living room? The living room. Ah, here we go. I actually thought you mean... I tried to get yeah. away from the android. Alright, that makes sense. The android murdered the victim... With the knife. With the knife. Okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous. But it doesn't tell us where the android went. Through the back. It was damaged by the bat. And lost some theory. Lost some what? Ethereum. You call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' biocomponents. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh. But I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. Right, here we go. So, Hank is neutral. So we need to find some blue blood traces, which I think I can see it coming along down there. I see it. I can see it. You know how it's led to the outside? Through the back door? Wait. 
Okay, so there are the traces. Aha, wait. A ladder was used. We can have a look up there. So it leads to the attic. Find something to climb. Go in here. I can't see. Open. What is it that I found? Obsessive writing. What is this? Malicious offering. Hmm. Well, well, well. Uh, we need to find a ladder. Well, we need to find a ladder. Find something to climb up. Maybe a chair. Yeah, we'll take the chair. Hey, 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 what are you doing with that chair? I'm going to check something. The attic. Uh, gonna check something. Place it. No, place it down here. Do you think the chair's stable? And open. There's a shadow. Do we go up? We gotta search the attic. Right, so we need to look for the defiant. Mm. So the blue blood traces up here. Oh. This is getting exciting now. Oh dear, here we go. Oh, it's a dummy. It's a dummy. Okay. So let's go. Okay, so follow the blue blood traces. Right, there's the Defiant. Oh, where's he running to? There's a pair of shoes. Are these Nike trainers? I don't know, I couldn't see well. Hold up. No, we gotta keep walking. I was just defending myself. He was gonna kill me. I'm begging you. Don't tell him. Connor, what the fuck is going on up there? It's here, Lieutenant! Oh, shit. Chris! Ben! Get your asses in here now! Come on! Whoa. Okay. Wow, I was surprised. Okay. Oof. So there we have it, um, part two, I'm going to end it right there, so there will be more Detroit Become Human um, in the next week or so, anyway, i tell you what, there's quite a few games that I enjoyed, so we're going to do one day of God of War, one day of Detroit, and perhaps one day of Dark Souls, and then the rest, um, maybe something different, but... There you go. So um, if you enjoyed the video today, um, hit the like button. 
Uh, don't forget to subscribe for more content and follow me on Twitter for updates. The links are in the description. Anyway, I will see you tomorrow for Mario Maker. So anyway, I hope you have a great weekend and uh, thank you for being with me um, for this extraordinary journey. And we're going to continue with that for the next week and so on anyway. So <clears throat> um, I will see you tomorrow. Anyway, I hope you have a wonderful day. Take care of yourselves and I'll catch you later. Peace out.